हमारा भी एकदम एकदम सामने बोल रहा हूँ सर यहाँ से स्टार्ट करो सर आवाज आ रही है आपको नहीं नहीं नीचे 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 मैम बैठ जाइए आप नीचे प्लीज नीचे आप एक काम कीजिए आप साइड में साइड में आ जाइए साइड में आ जाइए साइड में चेयर लेके बैठ जाइए लो एंगल यू वांट चेयर दस चेयर लेके जाओ नहीं 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 सॉरी सॉरी आप आ रहे हैं फ्रेम में आ रहे हैं आप फ्रेम में आ रहे हैं आप थोड़ा कैमरा ऊपर ले लो Take off your shoes and sit cross-legged and relax. Correct. Come on. Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. Are you upset? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. ये इतना क्यों सता रहे हो यार तो क्या रोले सबसे पहले तो प्रोमोज लोगों को बहुत ही पसंद आया है अपने किरदार के बारे में थोड़ा कुछ ब्रीफ कर दीजिए हमारी ऑडियंस को कि मतलब किस तरह का किरदार है आपका और या में आपका किरदार मेरा है एक बहुत ही सिंपल इंसान है रोहन और वो ब्लाइंड है लेकिन ब्लाइंड होने के बावजूद बहुत ही इंडिपेंडेंट है बहुत सेल्फ रिलायंट है उसमें कोई ऐसी बात नहीं है जिसे देखकर आपको लगे कि दिस मैन इज हेल्पलेस और ही इज नीडी और नॉट जस्ट माय कैरेक्टर बट आल्सो हर्स और ये एक जिम्मेदारी थी आई थिंक हमारी क्योंकि हमने जब रिसर्च किया तो वी फाउंड आउट दैट द ब्लाइंड इन द वर्ल्ड आर नॉट like how we imagine them to be so this was a responsibility to project the truth of society and uh, with the truth comes progress and awareness and all of that so this was very very important uh, for uh, me uh, to know that everybody in the film is bearing this responsibility absolutely uh, to portray the truth kyunki aajkal hamare jo misconceptions hain ब्लाइंड के बारे में हम सोचते हैं कि ब्लाइंड इज मोर लाइक यू नो आई थोड़ा हेल्प टाइप्स और फॉर दैट वी आर ओनली एट फॉर्ड क्योंकि हमारी पिक्चरों में दिखाया गया ऐसा कि ब्लाइंड मीन्स लाइक दिस सो इट इज़ टाइम दैट आर यू नो द मिस्टेक इज रेक्टिफाइड बाई आस ओनली सो और आई जस्ट वॉन्ट टू से दैट यू नो फॉर एग्जाम्पल Uh, the blind in our world uh, actually we are the ones who are blind to the yeah. blind world because in the blind world people are uh, the, the, there are blind photographers there are blind bodybuilders there are blind cricket players there are blind uh, ceos of companies lawyers i mean jo jo hum kar sakte hain wo kar sakte hain so what i would like to <coughs> re emphasize on is that they are differently abled abled but differently so there should be no reason to uh, overly sympathize and uh, you know think of them as uh, people who are needy because they are not they are so independent that is why we made our yeah. characters just like us to usme ek dar tha kyunki as actors when we do films जिसमें दी एनवायरमेंट बिल्ड्स अ सिंपथी फॉर द कैरेक्टर तो एक्टर्स फील वेरी सेफ के ये ऑथर बैक्ट है तो यू नो द एनवायरमेंट एंड स्क्रीन प्ले एंड द पीपल इन द फिल्म विल मेक अस लुक्स मोर स्पेशल इसमें वो नहीं है विच इज वाई इट इज 
new, which is why it is something that we are proud of that uh, we took that risk uh, as actors and as a film. <coughs> so, uh, uske, apart from that, uh, we have enjoyed the journey of the film. We have learned a lot of things. We have connected with some beautiful people in this film. Totally. Um, working with Yami has been, I think, uh, one of the most enriching experiences of my life. Uh, he is not only a actor, but uh, also as a human being, she has the abandon, innocence and the courage to be vulnerable. For an actor, it is so important to have the courage to be vulnerable. Because only when you are vulnerable can you uh, can you express <coughs> your emotions jo andar hai? Yes. ego aata hai, u, u, toh, you you get scared of showing your true self because what if they think i'm i'm weak or i'm less <coughs> so working with yami has been you know beautiful because uh, she also agrees with the kind of uh, thoughts i had for for the characters and uh, she's just taken it further i mean so, so really, really really honored that i had a you know this oh, opportunity yes. to work with an actor like her I think she's going to go a long, long way. And uh, after my maybe three, four years, uh, you know, I will be saying, you know, I worked with her. Oh, that is too much. You all, <laughs> so that is too much. Ek, ek, ek thi, mein, ah, ki thi uske that is Rithik for you. Rithik, the, <laughs> the reason why I'm, I was asked that, okay, when you wished him, you know, you called him, uh, he's a superstar, but a hu superhuman. That's what makes him because he's so modest and he's so humble. Honest, and I'm honest. Not modest. I'm no. Honest. <laughs> um, you know, when there's a movie ka promotion, or when you're asked what your experience was in the movie, or in the role of uh, portraying, or with your co-actor, then there's one thing to say, to say good things, which is the truth. But uh, when you're just talking, I think when uh, this kind of an excitement and happiness only comes when you really mean it from your heart. And I will always mean it that uh, I've said I fall short of words while talking about Ritik because he, it's working with him, I have, I, I would say, has been a rediscovery kind of for me as, as a person, as an actor. And I, I don't think I can ever be so gracious how he is because when Ritik works, uh, it's never an I. You I, me, 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 which we are more tempted. Hote hai. That's the most natural, I think, human uh, instinct or tendency we have. With Ritik, it's about we. Ritik, sirf jab kaam karte hai, sirf jase unhane kaha ki it's not, he's not just looking at himself. Sir, sirf ek selfless person, ek secure person, and a nice human can only do this where you want to not just excel at what you're doing, but also want to help elevate the other person's work, and which may not be only me. It could be anybody who's there in the frame or behind the camera or. Uh, he's just the reason why he's loved so much by every generation unanimously and he has all those labels because of the undying passion he has and you can't lie to a camera I think you can't be fake in front of a camera as a personality which comes across which and he's so honest he's so humble so now I got to know working with him why he's a superstar and you know you call him Greek God or we call him curve dance and this and that is he's earned it. He deserves every bit and much more. Uh, oh, this Thank love you. is not going to die that we all have for you. On set, you compliment each other. What kind of chemistry was on set? On set, I think uh, I and she were not there only. <laughs> we were just constantly the, the characters. characters. And uh, through the characters, I think there was uh, Rohan and uh, Supriya are, uh, you know, so so uh, vulnerable with each other and, and so respectful for e each other. Mm -hmm. And I think that has somewhere uh, seeped into our equation on the set as well. So there, uh, while working, we have, were connecting beautifully. Uh, okay. But we were, I think, mostly taking from the characters, the characters. And, and interacting <laughs> like, like them, you know. So it was uh, yeah, really, really it nice. Was Riddick, with the every movie you uh, you take up some new challenges and this time also you have taken up a challenge like uh, how difficult was it to behave when you can see everything but to add someone who can't see and yummy for you also like the, you went some through workshops or preparations how much time did that took 
Uh, it's difficult, yes, but that's why it's fun. No? I like doing things which are tough because I know what the fulfillment is after you achieve something that you thought was tough. Sure. When you do something easy, then the fruits of that is, nah, it's it's so I get bored <laughs> with that. So I rather do something that is, you know, tough. Um, so what was the second part of your question? Huh, the blind. The blind. Uh, it was difficult, yeah, because I think from all the films that I have done, uh, this was the most difficult uh, skill uh, to prep for, because the uh, eyes are a very small muscle and it's a involuntary muscle. So your even your eyelids you can control, but there are times when if there's something passing in front of your face, you know you'll flinch. And uh, sometimes in the action sequences, I had to keep my eyes open while something passes really quickly in front of my eyes. So uh, that was tough. But uh, we managed. We managed well. Uh, but apart from that, I, do, I don't think an actor's prep should be praised too much. You see the results. If the results are good, you praise that. Actor's prep should be a common thing. People should work hard. They should learn that, uh, you know, all the being cool and stuff should come after all the hard work is done. So don't start off if, you know, this is, I think, a message that is good for uh, uh, aspiring actors that uh, don't start off being cool, you know, I'm, <laughs> I'm cool like that and stuff. Don't start off with that. Start off with the work. Yeah. Be a laborer first and then you'll get your chance. You know, when the results are out, they all love it and stuff, then you'll be cool. Man. It's like, <laughs> that was easy for me and stuff. Uh, Yami, uh, Yami would like to know from your rating, is a superb dancer, <coughs> but to match up with his steps, and when I was thing. matching up to her. <laughs> no, no. That's and the and truth. That too, that Please I am a, I am a good dancer. <laughs> I am a good dancer. You're an awesome dancer. But, right? but in this song, I just, I don't, I'm not saying it means a lot, uh, but it's definitely the truth that there was a particular shot in this film, in in Monomore, where I saw what she was doing, uh. okay, and I liked that more. We were both doing the same step, but she, her style, was more was more fun, because she has a natural fray, uh, mm -hmm. flair, you know. Because uh, she's a she's a very happy person. She radiates that joy. So even in her language, you know, she radiates another kind of joy. So she was using her head also. She was, and I saw that and I said, <coughs> I, w I want to do it like this. So then I I I asked her to please come and just show me what you're doing once or twice. And I saw her, and then I copied what she was doing. And after that, I just want to pack up and just leave with a lot of happiness. <laughs> that wow, Rudik has said something like this. You know, I have a very weird ratio in my head when I sat down and thinking that hmm now where should we begin with I was like if you want to look half or maybe little half as as good you can't even come near him but half as good as Hrithik you gotta put in more than double the effort that he puts in and he works hard I can't even tell you to what level uh, that's the reason why he is he keeps reinventing himself every time be it any dance form or anything because he doesn't cease to learn or practice or rehearse. Never in the entire film scared or dance, I've heard the word, ha, ye ho jayega. Even if, even you can get up and say, ha, that's something very simple, suppose. No, let's all, yeah, let's come together, let's rehearse, let's own it and then just go for it. So when you see a Hrithik Roshan rehearsing so much and putting his heart and soul in, all those hours into it, you are obviously, uh, you're inspired and you want to give it even more than 100% and you feel good that, wow, if, you know, if, if that's the kind of attitude he comes and that's, that's true, huh? I mean, it's not just about me. Anybody, be it dance or anything, has a suggestion or he feels, oh, that's something looking nice, so let's try that. You have, that's an attitude which, it doesn't come with any that baggage or anything, or I'm expected to talk in a certain way, or I'm expected, so, something is expected out of me. Nothing. Just Hrithik, the actor, Hrithik, the hard-working, hard-working actor comes who wants, you know, to get the best out of himself and everybody. So uh. when all these things are there, all I have to do is nothing. Just, just like keep rehearsing till the time. Oh, but uh, it, you know, <laughs> it's really true what you said. I just want to add to that is that the point of the rehearsals is not uh, really to, uh, you know, look, look your best or uh, get the step and the angle, all of that right. That's not the end goal. The end goal really is to uh, do the steps so much 
that it becomes a part of yeah. your system, you know. You absorb it so much and then you can do it your way. Absolutely. Then you just do it, just fly with it and do it how you want to do that step. So then you forget about uh, the angles and you forget about True. the correctness. You just enjoy them. So that only comes if you've repeatedly done that a lot of times. And especially uh, the fact we have to also add that we, the, the visually uh, yeah, impaired factor exactly. to it. So, so we had to be perfect in the steps and then forget about the steps and do whatever came to us. Yeah. So yes, I think that's what makes it special. Yami, so uh, what is the one thing that you would take back from the characters that you played and implemented in your life? You know, uh, I think, uh, and probably this is somewhere true for the both of us, uh, that uh, yes, sometimes when you when you do films, you you know you you take back from the yeah. character. Uh, but I think a lot of the characters in this film actually have us uh, yeah, in it. In it. <laughs> so I think uh, what we what I can say that I take back is a, a kind of a benchmark. This film for me is a kind of a benchmark, and I don't want to speak too soon. But <coughs> at least with the experience that we've had, I think it's a it's benchmark experience. in our in our heads. That uh, you know, I will always hope. I will always maybe compare. Uh, you know, in my choices when I choose something, is it as invigorating <coughs> as it uh, was for Kabul? Uh, when I read Kabul script, I felt like this. Am I feeling that now? You know, the environment on the set. How do I recreate that kind of? So it's a kind of a benchmark that has uh, become in, totally. at least in my head. Totally. So <coughs> that is, I think. Uh, one of the things that I think we can yeah, implement. We uh, actually. Totally second now. Yeah. Uh, Rithik, Rithik, we had, Rithik, we had a word. <coughs> uh, Rithik, yeah. we had Rithik a put on great app because you've seen the magazine covers, you are sleek. So, what preparation did you go? Yeah, well, um, it's easy to gain weight. The only thing <laughs> I, I had to let go of is the uh, attachment to uh, the, you know, the labels. Sometimes actors can get very attached to labels like sexiest, you know, six pack abs and you know, he's known for this and he's known for that. Uh, I don't have a problem in letting go of that. So for Kabul, I knew that if I look as sharp as I did in uh, Krish or Bang Bang, <coughs> I would uh, not be being truthful to this character. So I wanted him to look, you know, sweet, you know, and, and uh, that's how I am. I mean, what Rohan is, is, is what I am actually. So uh, it wasn't uh, tough. It was just a decision that, OK, for this film, I'm going to let go of that. People are going to say, Kya hua tere ko? you've gained little weight, or you've lost weight, or you know, mm -hmm. you're not looking in shape, and all. What happened to your arms? <laughs> uh -huh. hoga. I prepared myself in normal, you know, in life, uh, when you meet uh, uh, some people. And I've been asked that. Kya hua tere ko? You're not well? <laughs> no, no, I'm, I'm fine. I not so sure. I'm just happy that the promos or songs the feedback has been so positive yeah. that we are really, really <laughs> Relieved, happy, excited that you know the buzz is so so positive. So very happy about that. <coughs> Sorry, whether it has a consequence or an effect on the box office, I don't. I'm not too sure. The promo, yes. I don't. Yeah. I don't know about the songs. I don't know about songs because there are so many songs that uh, have been released that have done hundred million views right. and the picture is not opened at all. So you know. I don't know what's going going on there. I think you believe, uh, you believe in uh, bo uh, box office numbers. Believe, it's not a ghost. It's there. <laughs> <laughs> box office number. Do you believe? I don't believe it exists. <laughs> it is there. Of course, I believe in them. But uh, I think what you're trying to ask is, do I do Does I go uh -huh. after the box office it numbers? Matters. The thing is, you can't go after it. You can only do good work. Box office mm -hmm. number comes to you. So I have to just, you know, do my work. That's all we can yeah, do. Yeah, really fantastic dialogue. If you can tell us one of your favorite dialogues from the movie, both of you. Oh, there are many dialogues. There are many, many dialogues. There are some very sweet ones between Sue and uh, Rohan. <coughs> very, very sweet ones. And uh, yeah, there's some you dramatic know, ones. Yeah, yeah, weirdly, it's, uh, I'll steal this answer from Rithi because I heard him say this. And I totally, that's another thing we have in common. If someone asks, you know, your favorite dialogue, I 
मुझे ना याद रहता है एकदम से और ना मैं कर पाऊंगी बिकॉज आई थिंक दैट माहौल इज ओनली डिफरेंट दैट इट्स इट्स टोटली डिफरेंट आई डोंट थिंक आई कैन एवर पोल इट ऑल वॉट वी कैन सेज फॉर यू इज more and more that's uh-huh. it that's <laughs> one, from, one from a promo which is being pretty popular like around darega so nahi kind of that nahi yaar you know that's that's a character and i i don't want i'm not a mimic i'm not a, you know i'm not somebody who does those lines because i can do them it comes from the character it comes from it happens in that moment uh so in that regard i am not a very good actor like i i can't just do <laughs> i get into it and something comes out it's nice it's great wow superb i i feel uh, you know belief that it it happened la that i can't do it <laughs> some can i don't know how to do it i think this was now one last question i just want to ask we had a word with rakesh sir and sanjay sir and he was telling like uh, there was a point ki jab aapne teen din continuously film ka shoot cancel karwa diya tha because you were preparing you have to imitate bachchan sir's voice would you like to share that experience like you were preparing yourself for the bachchan sir uh, Scene. Yeah, there is a scene in the film where I have to uh, take out Mr. Bachchan's voice of all the voices in the world. <laughs> Bachchan's voice, like how am I going to do that? Uh, so I thought, पहले मैंने सोचा कि कोई नहीं है, you know. Uh, eventually, we will request uh, Mr. Bachchan to come in, you know, dub those lines, and I'll just act them out, and he can dub them afterwards. But for the set, I had to still rehearse, no. I had to give the shot. So for the shot, I started to rehearse, you know, his style and stuff. Dicta phone hath me or uh, one whole day I practiced. Uske baad, when I played back, I heard my voice and uh, it was sounding not bad. Huh? I was like, <laughs> but I thought, yeah, this is just me. You know, I should get some feedback. So the next day, I practiced one one more day and uh, I got a lot of positive feedback. Hey, it looks like you can do this. so i took that leap of faith and uh, on the set i did it myself and when sanjay heard that he said locked <laughs> i am not getting this dubbed at all you are going to do this uh, you are uh, you've al- already done this so i again got to learn something more that uh, and oh uh, research ke time pe i read some uh, <coughs> material on uh, dubbing artists and i realized that you can actually recreate anybody's voice in the world if you just get control of the muscles of your vocal cords if you get the control of that you can actually alter your pitch tone all of that to match somebody's voice <coughs> so uh, you know that information helped me it it uh, assured me that if i practice maybe i can do it so and it have happened so wow believed it reasons why the audience must go and watch kabir first day first show but why did you say five mm-hmm. give me 10 we have many we'll give you one <laughs> you give that's our heart we've given our heart out to you lovely i think yes. there is nothing more than that. special than heart and this film has been made <laughs> with a lot of love and heart and i i i hope they have <laughs> their own reasons to watch uh, this yeah. film. i don't think we need to give them one i right. hope they all have their own uh, the only reason and if we don't then of course we can't force them <laughs> so please if you thank you very much all right thank you